else, and welcome to Silly Storytime. My name is Mr. Andy, and I'm a children's librarian here at the Santa Ana Public Library. I'm glad you could join me. So today we're going to be reading some silly stories. I have some fun finger plays and rhymes that I'm going to be sharing, and I'm even going to be introducing you to one of my library friends. But before we go ahead and move on to story time, I want to go ahead and greet everybody, and I do that by singing the welcome song. And the welcome song is called, We Clap and Sing Hello. And it goes like this. So I'm going to go ahead and go through it once, a little bit slower, so you guys can learn the words. And I'll go through it a second time. So here we go. We clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we clap and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we wave and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we stomp and sing hello. All right, so nice job, boys and girls. So I'm going to go ahead and sing that one more time. Here we go. We clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we clap and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we wave and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we stomp and sing hello. All right, so great job, boys and girls. All right, so now boys and girls, I want to go ahead and, and share some finger plays with you. And I want to go ahead and start with one called Open Shut Then. So for this song, we're all going to get our fingers out, give them a little wiggle, give them a little shake, get them all warmed up. All right, so we'll go through this song two times, boys and girls. Um, we'll go the first time a little bit slower, and then the second time you guys can go ahead and join me as well. All right, so it goes like this. Open Shut Then them open shut them give a little clap 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 open shut them open shut them place them in your lap 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 creep them crawl them creep them crawl them right up to your chin 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 open up your little mouth Great job, everyone. So we're going to go ahead and sing that song one more time, but we're going to go faster. So are you guys ready? Here we go. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Place them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, crawl them. Creep them, crawl them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. Open up your little mouth. <laughs> All right. So great job, boys and girls. So now I'm going to go ahead and move on to our second finger play. And this one's called Two Little Blackbirds. So can you go ahead and get out your two little blackbirds? All right, here we go. Two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and the other named Jill. Fly away, Jack. Fly away, Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. All right. So our next pair of blackbirds, boys and girls, they are sitting on a cloud, and they are quiet and loud. Here we go. Two little blackbirds sitting on a cloud. One named quiet and the other named loud. Fly away, quiet. Fly away, loud. Come back loud! All right. Nice job, boys and girls. And we have one last pair of blackbirds, and they are sitting on a gate, and they are early and late. So here we go. Two little blackbirds sitting on a gate. One named early and the other named late. Fly away early, fly away late. second. 
there it goes. Come back early, come back late. It's taking his time. Hmm. And there it comes. All right, so great job, boys and girls. And now we're gonna go ahead and move into our first story. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start off, boys and girls, with a book by one of my favorite authors called Mo Willems. And this book is called, That Is Not A Good Idea. And we're reading this with permission from Harper Collins. So that is not a good idea. So you, as you can see, we have there's a fox, and he spots a goose. What do you think he's thinking of? Hmm. What luck! Dinner! Excuse me, would you care to go for a stroll? Does that sound like a good idea, boys and girls? I don't think so. Sure. That is not a good idea. It's not a good idea. Would you care to continue our walk into the deep dark woods? I don't think that sounds fun at all, right? I think it's a trap. That is really not a good idea. Would you care to visit my nearby kitchen? It looks like they're going into the woods, huh? I don't think that's a good idea. What about you guys? I think they're right. Not a good idea. Would you care to boil some water for soup? Certainly. I do love soup. Uh oh. Let's see. That is really, really, really not a good idea. Would you care to look at my soup? A key ingredient is missing. Hmm. What do you boys and girls think is missing? That is really, 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 really not a good idea. Yeah, that's a terrible idea, huh? expect that? <laughs> well, we did try to warn him. Right? They were trying to tell the fox it wasn't a good idea. Doesn't look like he listened, huh? More soup, children! And that, boys and girls, is the end. All right, so now, boys and girls, I want to go ahead and introduce you to, to one of my library friends. And this friend is an animal. He likes to swing from tree to tree or in the library from shelf to shelf. And he likes to eat bananas. What type of animal, boys and girls, do you think my friend is? Let's see if you're right. So if you said monkey, you were you are indeed correct, boys and girls. This is my friend Spike. So Spike, can you go ahead and say hi to the boys and girls watching us from home? All right, nice job. 
And Spike lives here at the library. He, he loves to read books. He loves going to story time. But he also likes to play a game. He has a favorite game that he likes to play. Do you boys and girls want to play a game with Spike? All right. He likes to play a game called Monkey See, Monkey Do, and it's, it's a pretty simple game. All you do is watch Spike, and you do what he does. Alright, so are you guys ready to play? Good. Alright, you ready, Spike? Let's get started. So, Spike, what would you like the boys and girls to do first? Alright, so it looks like he wants you to clap your hands, boys and girls. Can you guys clap your hands? Nice job. <laughs> All right, so what's next? What's next, Spike? Looks like he's touching his toes. Can you boys and girls touch your toes? Nice job. All right, so what's next, Spike? Yeah, I think he's giving himself a hug, boys and girls. Can you guys give yourselves a hug? Or if you have a mom or dad nearby or a loved one, you can give them a hug as well. Right? It makes us feel nice and good inside to get hugs and to give hugs as well. All right. Let's see. So what's next, Spike? All right, so I think he's hiding his eyes, boys and girls. Can you hide your eyes? Peek-a-boo! All right. He's hiding his eyes again. Peek-a-boo! All right, he's doing it one more time. Spike loves to play peekaboo if you haven't noticed. Peekaboo! All right, I think it's time to move on to the next, the next thing, Spike. Peekaboo! All right, so let's see what's next. What's next, Spike? So it looks like he's reaching up to the sky. Can you boys and girls lift your arms up high? Reach for the sky. All right, nice job. And bring them down. And he's doing it again, reaching up to the sky. All right, and he's bringing them down. All right, so great job, Spike. So thank you for playing our game with Spike, boys and girls. I'm going to go ahead and uh, put Spike down so he can eat a snack. He likes to eat a banana after we play his game. So I'm going to put him away right over here. So why don't you go ahead and say bye to the boys and girls, Spike, and we'll, we'll see you next time. So, now, boys and girls, we're going to go ahead and move into one of my favorite rhymes. It's called Go Bananas. And so, what we'll do is we'll go through it once so that you guys can, can learn uh, the lyrics, the words, and we'll go through it a second time. All right? So, here we go. So, we start by spreading out our legs. We're going to put our hands up like this, and we're going to start by forming the orange. So, we're going to make a circle shape, and that's going to be the orange. So we're going to go form the orange, form, form the orange. Then we're going to peel the orange, peel, peel the orange. And then we're going to squeeze the orange, squeeze, squeeze the orange, squeeze the orange, squeeze, squeeze the orange. All right, very good, boys and girls. Next, we're going to go ahead and form the potato. And the potato is going to be little bigger than the orange right so just like this so we're gonna form the potato form form the potato peel the potato peel peel the potato now we're gonna mash the potato mash mash the potato mash the potato mash mash the potato all right great job and then last we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna form a banana for the banana we're gonna lift our hands up and meet her fingers right above our head. <laughs> so here we go. Form the banana. Form, form the banana. Peel the banana. Peel, peel the banana. Go bananas. Go, go bananas. Go bananas. Go, go bananas. All right. So great job, guys. So we're going to do that one more time all the way through. So here we go starting with the orange. So let's form the orange. Form, form the orange. Peel the orange. Peel, peel the orange. Squeeze the orange. Squeeze, squeeze the orange. Squeeze the orange. Squeeze, squeeze the orange. 
Form the potato. Form, form the potato. Peel the potato. Peel, peel the potato. Mash the potato. Mash, mash the potato. Mash the potato. Mash, mash the potato. And then last, we have the banana. So let's form the banana. Form, form the banana. Peel the banana. Peel, peel the banana. Go bananas. Go, go bananas. Go bananas. Go, go bananas. All right. So great job, boys and girls. All right. So our next story, boys and girls, is called, Is That Wise Pig? And this one was written by Jan Thomas. And we're reading this with permission from Simon & Schuster. Silly, look, he has a galosh on his head, huh? Who wants to help me make soup? I do! You guys like soup? I love soup. Here is one onion. I have one, right? Here are two cabbages. Can you count with me, boys and girls? We have one, two, and here are three umbrellas. Yeah, one, two, three. But do you put umbrellas in soup, boys and girls? I don't think so, right? But what do we use umbrellas for? We use them in the rain, right, to keep dry. Yeah. Uh, three umbrellas? In the soup? Right. Don't do that. Is that wise, pig? Is that wise? Oh, I guess not. Now, here are four tomato so let's count them boys and girls we have one two three and four here are five potatoes one two three four five and here are uh-oh let's pick up two six galoshes Six galoshes in the soup? You guys put galoshes in a soup? Not unless you want stinky soup, right? Yeah. They go on your feet. Uh, is that wise, pig? Not a, not a very wise thing, right? Oh, I guess not. Now, here are seven green beans. Let's count them, boys and girls. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven green beans. Huh? Here are eight Brussels sprouts. And here are, uh oh, let's pick up two, nine carrots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine carrots. And is carrots something you would put in soup? Yeah, so that's actually pretty wise, huh? Pretty wise, huh? Yes! That is wise. And... Uh-oh, uh what did they do? I asked ten hungry friends to join us. Was that wise, pig? Here come the friends. Uh-oh. They look hungry. Uh-oh. Better use these. All right. Got the galoshes and the umbrellas. <laughs> the umbrellas and galoshes were pretty wise, pig. Thanks, Cal. Right, 
was a wise idea because the pigs are making a mess over here, right? They're being pigs, but they're not getting dirty because they have their galoshes and the umbrellas, right? <laughs> so that was wise. <laughs> There's just one thing missing. Uh, really? What's that, pig? What do you guys think is missing? He's gonna jump into the soup too, huh? Pizza? Mm hmm. Pizza. Right? They're gonna order pizza. They want nothing to do with the soup, right? <laughs> All right, and that is the end, boys and girls. So that was Is That Wise Pig by Jan Thomas. So now, boys and girls, we're going to go ahead and move into our closing song. And for our closing song, we're going to sing a song called Zoom, Zoom, Zoom. All right? So for this song, we're going to go ahead and we're going to rub our hands together just like this. All right? And we'll go through it once, and then we'll do it again a second time. So everybody ready? Here we go. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. Zoom, 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 we'll be there very soon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard our rocket ship. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Last off! <laughs> so nice job, boys and girls. And we're going to do that one more time. One more time. So are you guys ready? Here we go. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We'll be there very soon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard our rocket ship. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and blast off! <laughs> All right, so great job, boys and girls. So that was story time, everyone. I want to thank you for joining me, and I hope that you will join me next time. So, I'll see you next time, boys and girls. <laughs>